Learn how to hand style and diffuse dry to enhance natural lived in texture. First, we prep the hair, post wash on damp hair. In the roots, I am using a texturizing spray to enhance volume in the root area. I'm using a light curl gel in the mids to ends to activate texture. And to complete my prep, I'm using a curl cream to smooth and nourish the hair. Making sure you thoroughly emulsify the products into the hair evenly. I am using a mesh diffuser by YS Parks. The goal of this style is a modern head hugging shape with maximum texture and activation. We direct our clients to face down towards the floor. This will help to create a head hugging shape. If you wanted maximum body, I would direct the head the opposite way. Check the card above for an in-depth tutorial. Directing the diffuser's airflow over the crown and down to the nape. We use the opposite hand to cradle our sections up whilst directing the airflow down. Whilst the hair's drying, we want to minimize running our hands through the hair. This will help to avoid fluff and also allow the curl or wave to activate in full dimension. This method will help to enhance the texture and wave without manipulating it in its natural state. You can use hand styling techniques to twist the hair, heating and then allowing it to set to create more undone lived in texture. We continue to work around the head shape using elevation and our client's body position to control the desired shape. Making sure I don't run my hands through the hair, gently cradling the hair to avoid fluff or frizz. We continue this process until the hair is 80 to 90% dry. Now you can start manipulating the hairstyle without disturbing the hair texture. I like to go over my shape with cool air, helping the hair to set for a longer lasting result. You can now run your hands through the hair. Give the shape a shake out or leave it how it is. You can finish with serum to add shine and dimension or texture spray for volume and texture or sea salt spray for more lived in dimension. If you like this tutorial, you need to watch this one next.